The money was collected, people got receipts for it, but it never, it never made it to the bank. Each Sunday, the families and retirees who make up the congregation at the Roman Catholic Parish of St. Bernadette faithfully fill the offering plate. They're just now learning over the last few years, $400,000 of that money was stolen. It's a serious breach of, of trust, and, and I think the, the sense of betrayal is probably going to be quite high. In court documents, the church's financial administrator is accused of embezzling the money over five years, beginning in 2009. The financial issues became apparent during a routine audit by the Archdiocese of St. Boniface. It was not apparent at first. It's something that we discovered as we went along. And the totals kept rising and rising and rising. According to auditors, the thefts began with small amounts, but by the end of the five years, the sums had risen substantially. They allege $120,000 went missing in 2014 alone. According to staff, the church ran deficits for years, with parishioners constantly being asked to dig deeper and give more to make up for the shortfall. We don't know why the revenues are down, uh, you need to give more, and they were frustrated because it just seemed that the more they, the more they tried, uh, they just kept getting the, the feedback that it's, it's not enough. The missing funds include $100,000 earmarked for renovations at the church. The parish also had to cut back on donations to charities both here in Winnipeg and overseas. Leo McCoggin, seen here on vacation in Ecuador, faces three charges related to fraud, theft and falsifying documents. He quit his job a few months before the audit, telling colleagues he planned to take a year off before finding a new job. Ben Milger, CTV News, Winnipeg.